The Getty Villa Visitor Center, which many at the museum refer to as the addition, was designed by Machado and Silvetti Associates, which was founded by Rodolfo Machado and George Silvetti. Silvetti attended the University of California, Berkeley, which has a mixture of modern and classical buildings. This mixture may have influenced in some way the contrast between the modern addition and the Getty Villa. Silvetti has taught at Harvard, leading studios and lecturing on history, contemporary theory, and criticism. These lessons include lessons on classical and Renaissance architecture, which were major parts in the Getty Villa Visitor Center. In 1980, Machado and Silvetti participated in the first Venice Architecture Biennale, which had the theme of the presence of the past. A similar theme was followed for the design of the Getty Villa Visitor Center. The Getty Villa Visitor Center is an expansion to the Getty Villa Museum. Machado and Silvetti had to design the addition with the Getty Villa Museum in mind. The Getty Villa is based around the ancient Villa de Papiri in Herculaneum, a city northwest of Pompeii. The outdoor theater design was inspired by outdoor theaters present in both cities. Machado and Silvetti visited Herculaneum and Pompeii to attain more context on the Getty Villa site. Both Pompeii and Herculaneum were excavation sites, which inspired the architects to model the addition as an excavation site. To do this, the path is raised and parallel to the Getty Villa, allowing for views from an elevated height similar to the, an excavation site. The architects had the idea of architectural promenade in mind when designing the path from the parking lot to the villa. At the start of the path, visitors enter the entry pavilion, providing a start to the architectural experience at the site. Next, they are presented with a wooden shading structure using a post and beam system. This shading structure is oriented in a way to subtly guide the visitor from the stairs or elevator to the direction the path continues. The walkway is parallel to the Getty Villa, giving the aforementioned feeling that one is at an excavation site, looking down at the ruins of an ancient Roman villa. Next, the outdoor theater is reached and the view opens up. One can clearly see the main entrance to the villa, as well as the cafe. The modern design of the cafe currently contrasts the Getty Villas. Some classical inspired elements are used, such as columns, to make sure the contrast is noticeable while not detracting from the villa. Past the cafe is a courtyard providing a way down that connects the top and bottom sections of the visitor center. And finally, the visitor is at the entrance of the Getty Villa Museum.